Hello everyone, I'm Pravin Kumar. Today I'm going to show you how to integrate Google Meet in your Moodle site. In order to do that, you need to uh, go to the site administration in Moodle and click on plugins and you have to install plugins. There, there are two options. Uh, in install plugins either you can pull your uh, file in zip, zip, zip file or install the plugins from Moodle plugin directories so I have already installed this Google Meet plugin in my Moodle site so I can directly go to the other options so let's uh, hit the turn editing on and add an activity or resource so you can find out Google Meet or you can directly go to the options resources you can easily find out Google Meet for Moodle uh, in arranged in alphabet in G so I can click on it and I'm going to do something demo I'm going to schedule the time when I'm going to start this meeting and I'm going to enter when I'm going to end the meeting and I'm going to do save and display you need to go back to your plugins Hit on plugins overview. I need to click settings option in Google Meet. So there are options here. I have to fill it using API key and authentication client ID. So which I have to get it from Google API services. So as I already did that. So there are other options here, dashboard, library, credentials, and authentication concern screens. So I do it. I go to credentials. So I get all these options. It should be in green color. So I go here, edit API key. API key. I have to uh, do this uh, HTTP. I like do the restrictions as HTTP uh, refers and have to select scopes which I need uh, to run the Moodle Google, uh, Google Meet on my Moodle. So I have selected four uh, scopes. So for that, I have to click it here and can select uh, so many scopes whichever I need. Uh, to perform Google Meet on my Moodle. So all, all I need, I have to do, I uh, have to save them. So I can copy my API key from here. It has copied uh, to the clipboard. Uh, I can reach here, I can paste the same on the API key box. I can paste the same. Again, I have to copy my indication content screen keys. So I have to edit tradition client I have to fill these names uh, my application name is tropical soils and URL uh, URL is uh, stpps and tropical soils dot in and, and my client ID and client secret keys all given here I have to copy And save it. 
so I can copy it. I can also copy it from here and it has been copied in my clipboard I have to paste same uh, in the in my Moodle go to meet for Moodle content so once I've done uh, I can do this save changes yes it is done now so I have done uh, the required keys and client ID for my Google Meet for Moodle. Once again, in authentication console screen, I can edit my app. I have to click uh, edit my app and I have to enter all the details or basic information required for uh, authentication console screen like my app name and user support email and I don't want my app logo so I can leave it blank as it is and app domain I'm entering the uh, domain directories and I have to copy down the privacy policy link from my website my yes there it is so I have the privacy policy a link which you should I have to copy from or which should I, I have to copy the URL from here and I have to paste it uh, paste it in the privacy policy link the same I have to copy the terms of services link uh, from this web page paste down here in that authentication console screens so I have to detail the developer contact information and I have to do save and continue second one is scopes so I have to detail and select the sensitive scopes which I required so I have selected uh, Google Calendar API and Google Drive API so it should be auth slash calendar and auth slash uh, drive which I have selected by add or remove scopes so as I already selected my there are many scopes are here so you have to select your specific uh, API or scopes so I've selected calendar and drive API so it should be slash AUTH slash drive Then you need to do update. You need to update your scopes, and you also have to fill uh, this justification why and how the scopes will be helpful uh, for your site. So I have detailed um, how it is helping. So it helps to schedule. The events and it may be sync. It can be synced with the Google Calendar, and the drive can help saving the recordings of the Google Meet on my Moodle site. And I also have to uh, copy and paste the video video of my demo. So I have to copy down from. Uh, my YouTube account so I already paste uh, published this video on my YouTube account all I have to do this I have to copy this uh, video URL and I have to paste it here since I already pasted it here and I can save and continue this so there are optional informations I have to give the other and um, I have to skip so other content and final review uh, I have to review my information so user time is external app name and support email 
and I have not provided the any logos and the application home page link and privacy uh, privacy policy link service for, so terms of services link and authorized domains and contact email addresses and I have to, ver I'm, I have to verify that uh, scopes so which is not yet verified so I have to submit this for verification process so I'm also given the, the scope justifications in detail scope justification detail and thank you